The Lake Sunapee Cruising Fleet is a nonprofit volunteer organization dedicated to the sport of sailboat racing and creating friendships. They've been in existence since 1984. Recently, our YCN crew put out with Debbie and Bruce Campbell, and they instructed us on some of the finer points of lake life. It was a nice night to be on this beautiful lake. The series includes two divisions. As the boats jockey for position before the start, the object is to be as close to the starting line as possible without going over before the horn to start. Then the race is on. In Division 1, the boats have to cover a 3.35 mile course and Division 2 sees a 2.95 mile circuit this night. Going downwind, the strategy is to go as fast as you can, then positioning your boat to pivot around the marker on the correct side, or you have to go back around. Then, tacking back upwind is where a sailor's skill really shines. Kind of where the rubber meets the road, or in this case, where the hull meets the water. I'm still not sure who has the right of way as they crisscross each other, but there does seem to be a protocol for tracking in and around each other. Then comes the finish, which seems to be set in place well before the finish line. Some more obvious than others, as demonstrated by Division One's Boulder Dash, skippered by Al Peterson, coming in almost two minutes ahead of Vinto of Terry Fletcher, followed closely by the eclipse of Bob Henry. With the handicapping system, the order was adjusted to Vento, Eclipse, then Boulder Dash.